Hey, it's Mark Shepard. I literally, I was about to get into the shower and I thought I would check, uh, just check the charts. And literally, I came in at the moment that Litecoin makes its break. May not be the you know the final break, but we're on the one hours. Let's go to the, the thirty minutes. We're pushing forty nine. Let's see what they're doing on the one minute here. This is it, baby. This is this is Litecoin breaking out of its trading range, and I've been talking about it and talking about it for two weeks now, and it's so cool to just watch it. It's it's just doing it. Let me go back. Again, through the 30s, the one hours, and the one day. And it was weird because I just went to Twitter and I was, uh, I follow Charlie Lee, who I, I guess he's nervous when he speaks in public because his tweets are pretty good. <laughs> his tweets are, are lively. Um, and, uh, and what's really cool is SegWit just happened, okay? And and SegWit happened two hours ago, supposedly. And what Charlie Lee talked about in his article that he wrote back in January was that, um, <laughs> I'm sitting here without a shirt on, uh, he said back in January that, easy ladies, that it's like Bitcoin's a highway and it's clogged with cars. And Litecoin is kind of a parallel highway and there's hardly any traffic. And what SegWit does is it builds bridges between the two so that you can get off Bitcoin onto the Litecoin highway and then back onto the Bitcoin highway kind of so they can go back and forth uh, and it'll help both of them. That was like, wow, that was cool. So like if you're at a store and they only take Bitcoin and you only have Litecoin, you could just swap it right over Kind of like if you have, um, you know, a gold coin and X number of silver coins, you can kind of interchange them. Well, I don't have that amount in gold, but I have the same amount in silver, swap it, right? But I like the idea of the highway because these really are networks of value, networks of value. So anyway, uh, of course, Litecoin's backing off now. It's shy. I thought it was going to hit 50. I really did, right while I was on the, uh, right on camera here. It's still at 49. On the one hours, 49.250. Oh, come on. Come on, bit. Come on, Litecoin. Come on, Litecoin. You can do it, honey. There you go. Come on, girl. Get a girl. You can do it. You can do it, Litecoin. All right, hey, it's Mark Shepard, and just a quick little follow-up to my earlier video when Litecoin started to break out. It is right now pushing, pushing, come on, baby, 54.487. Litecoin is going to test this 56 mark, I think. And if it breaks out of this, people, we don't know. It could be wildly speculatively exciting let's get the let's get it framed a little bit here all right so i'm going to run through this while it's deciding whether it really wants to go for it we're right at a pivotal moment in a market move so it, it popped up on the one hours and it's pulling back you know it, it it's kind of like <laughs> it's like someone blowing up a balloon 54 it's playing at 54 it wants 55. Come on, baby. You know you want 55. Come on, baby. Come on. We're on the one minute. Oh, come on. What was that all about? Someone's taking profits. Oh, no. Come on. Come on. Come on. No, we want some. We want some. Come on. I want some, too. Come on. Come on. Oh, here, sucker. I'll sell it to you. I'll sell it to you at 54. What's my... Uh, <laughs> My value is up to uh, 
1,091.91, and it was like 970-something. I've really noticed doing this that I cannot hold numbers in my mind, and I think I think I might, as a kid in elementary school, have been non-diagnosed with dyslexia. <laughs> you know, I just kind of muddled my way through. I'm fine with words, uh, but numbers, I, I, it seems like they just, I can't seem to hold them in my brain. But if I write stuff down, I understand the concepts. So uh, we all have to work with our own handicaps and talents and challenges. Um, so anyway, that's a little philosophy while we're watching the bots take their profits. All right, well, I can't watch any longer. <laughs> I, I want to see her go. I want to see her make a run for it. I don't want to see a step back. It's breathing, I know. That's what I tell all you guys every day. It's breathing. But hey, we did break out, people. That is, that's a significant breakout. And I'll check back later and see where we are. And hopefully I can edit all this out so you can catch the excitement but not have to watch a 10-hour video. Um, so that's it for now. I'll come back in a little bit and see where it's how it's doing. And uh, again... I have called almost every single one of these breakouts out of these trading ranges. And that to me is really a little bit of an affirmation that I'm not crazy. You know, that this is something I'm good at, that I like to do, uh, and that I like as much as music, right? It has to be something as interesting to me as music and psychology. And uh, speaking of music, if you haven't checked out my Bitcoin theme song, Freedom, check it out. You just uh, type in your little... YouTube search engine, Freedom, Bitcoin song, Mark Shepard, and it should come up. And uh, I appreciate you guys uh, paying attention and subscribing and all that kind of stuff. And uh, I'll be back in a little bit. Yeah, so on the one minute, it got as high as 54.716 before it kind of took a step back. And these are bots taking profits. And I'm hoping it's controlled finance because... Uh, <laughs> Because I believe in them. So they have charts. They have charts on their website. So it looks like we might have a little, little more energy in here. But uh, again, I'll be back if it moves. If not, this will be the end. <laughs> okay, so it's a few minutes later. And Litecoin is really testing this. This is the real breakout line. Draw it down here, move it up. Okay, this is the real breakout line right here. You know, right in the $55 range. That's where we are right at this moment. And let's just check the one minute and see if we're, yeah, see it, see how it, see the resistance? See the freaking resistance. It just, it has to believe that it can go farther. Someone has to freaking believe. Make this a little bigger. But even on the one minutes, the uh, the down minutes are much, there are much fewer of them. And the bottoms... are still higher. This is it, baby. Let's go to the 30s. See what we're doing in the 30s. In the one hours. It's right at the top of the chart, and that silly thing's in the way. We are here. We're here, B. We're here. We're doing it. It's about to happen. We hit 55. Right there at that 55. It's just, that's, it did break through. It broke through. Cool. What's my wallet looking like here? Litecoin. 1,099, it was 997, something like that. No, 975, something like that. Again, numbers. <laughs> it's going up. I know it's going up because I see a picture. I see a picture on a chart. So, yeah. So, I'm going to keep monitoring this, but I want to get this video up and out on YouTube uh, so you guys can see it. 
And if you missed it, you can watch it happen. Hey, if you like this, please, please subscribe. Please share. Please check out the stuff I have below each video. I've got resources and links and discounts and codes and websites and music and courses and all kinds of stuff. So check it out and let me be your personal crypto cranker as I guide you into the galaxy of grooviness. <laughs> and uh, thanks for watching, guys. I appreciate it very much. Mark Shepard, peace. Over now. Start the music.